In the 1980s, the Cold War was reaching its highest point, and the US Air Force was searching for a new jet fighter. The new Soviet fourth-generation fighters such as the Su-27 and the MiG-29 were proving adept as direct competitors to US F-14s and F-15s. In 1986 US Air Force held Advanced Tactical Fighter ATF, competition among the defense contractors. The YF-22 by Lockheed, Boeing, and General Dynamics, and the YF-23 by Northrop and McDonnell Douglas were the outcome. The YF-23 was faster, and it also proved to be harder to detect on radar, though the YF-22 was more maneuverable. The YF-23's wings resembled a diamond, with a smaller profile than the YF-22. Each prototype's weapon bay could have held four AIM-120 missiles. If the aircraft had gone into production, it could have also been equipped with a 20mm Vulcan cannon and an additional weapon bay for Sidewinder missiles. But obviously Air Force had to choose between the two aircraft, and they preferred the YF-22 that ultimately became the F-22 Raptor.